Okay, just finished another master task. Got Iron Man here doing a task for Vedions with Karazi Chaps. Couldn't help but notice, I thought it was pretty funny. I need his blessing though, otherwise. And I need his blessing, otherwise it's gonna be nothing. I need it. Okay, okay, wish me luck, good luck. Oh, what the fuck is that, bro? Ninja Implings, I mean, two Infernals. Uh, Mystic Sand Legs, Lava Demons, and then a Rune Plate Bodies. It's doable, so we shall do it. Maybe not in one evening, but get started on it. Oh, hey, he has some, okay. Start with the Rune Plate Bodies. All right, for a change, I decided to also go ahead and run a master task on my account. I actually got a very good one. Um, just got a high elk for Saradoman Swords. Why did that charge my fucking prayer? Ah, god damn it, that's annoying. Okay, well, gotta get all my prayer points to zero again, because I have to be at zero prayer to do this task. Uh, there should be two Saradoman Swords in here. Just need to high elk them. But we gotta be at zero prayer, so I literally have to wait until that runs out, because I didn't know changing your spellbook restored prayer. I mean, not much I could have done about it, because I had to change my prayers, but, you know, let's wait for a minute. Alright, here we go. Last Eridoman sword. Another master completed. 35 already. Let's see what this one has. A third age wand. I mean, that's the first announcement on this account in a while. And it is 10k rune coins, so, you know, not the worst. We'll take it. Well, got another master task right away, and for once in my life, I am happy that this nightmare lock has a pet on it as one of the very few items, because this one requires a nightmare pet. Was not expecting that. I don't even know if the terror pet would work for it, but uh, wait, let, let's try real quick. Nope, has to be a nightmare pet. Wow, lucky I got one for once. And then some Callistos and High Elk King 2 Dragon Claws. That ain't too bad at all. So let's get that done uh, in a bit as well. We also have three little imbuing stones to roll real quick. See if we get spoon even more. Probably not right. Don't think so. Yeah, that's okay. I also enchanted a bunch more bottles just now with everything we had. So we got 18 more in the vault. Things are looking pretty good. And a bit of room coins in here and stuff. Oh, wild leg. Rest escape like five seconds ago because of the demo. Any epic lux? Wow, that is terrible. A couple of a room coin exchanges to bring up the stack again because I just used a lot of it. But I'm almost out of afflictions and the mods are running a little low, mainly damage modifiers. So doing a few exchanges is also not a bad idea at all. All right, another master task completed. Give us the Zemurak Godsword, please! Lava Dragon Mask and a Mystery Chest. Two announcements. Once again, that's what we're looking for. Alright, won't be able to commentate much from here on because it's getting a little late, but we got a little Harbringer spawning, so... Let's see if me or Ghost can snatch herself a Torfa Legs or a Helm. Or even a Hilt would be nice still, to get like multiple HS ores in the future. But, uh... Yeah, let's see if we get anything at all. Ain't no fucking way I just got a sun spear. <laughs> That's sick as fuck. Well, I was not expecting that. Huh. Alright, good morning, it's a brand new day, can commentate normally again. Last night did a bit of Karazi, I'm gonna start the grind because we want to gather a bunch of blood diamonds. We would like to get a few Karazi accumulators, I don't know what for, but we just want to have a couple while we're there. And then, um, uh, getting blood diamonds to make Sanguinesti eyes as well as blood rapiers to potentially make Holy Grazi rapier eyes. Obviously we got that extra Holy Rapier a while ago. So uh, getting a Blood Rapier to combine it into the imbued version, not bad to have. I'm also kinda kinda hoping that when TOA comes out, they use certain old school RuneScape restrictions like how the defense can't be lowered beyond like 70% for most of the bosses. And uh, 
Stuff like stab being best in slot against Baba, because that could make items like the Holy Rapier so good for specific things, you know? I would love to see something like that, but uh, outside of that, gonna elixir up, go back to Razi, kill a few more jungle demons, had a lot of fun yesterday. Didn't think I would get a Sunspear tree killed in, I was not prepared, I didn't even see it on the floor at first, because it's a yellow item on the floor rather than like the... Uh, no, I guess the yellow would be good normally, it just doesn't, it kind of blends in with the sand there, I guess that's the issue. So I didn't really notice it at first and I was like, oh, what the fuck, I got another sun spear. Obviously, took it off the island right away, it is trash, sad to say, but it's just a really bad weapon. I wish they would buff it for the fucking love of god, but they won't, or they haven't. Um, the big problem on the island with it is that you have a jungle totem, and almost every weapon in the fucking game is better with a jungle totem than the sun spear. So, the fact that it's two-handed is kind of its un undoing, and the same goes with Off-Island. Uh, once again, because it's two-handed, it's not that great, it just ain't. Uh, yeah, you're better off using like the Elder Zemi Spear, and then you have the capabilities of like using a Divine and Corp and stuff like that. So, yeah. But, it is an Elite Wanderer task, so it's most certainly not entirely useless. Um, got a little something-something to spend it on there, so... Yeah, let's go ahead and go back to the island. Maybe we'll get another Sun Spear, but I would love to get the Razi Dagger from Jungle Demon in order to use that Naza Stroll. And I would love to get um, more Blood Diamonds from him, because he does drop them quite regularly. We already had over 100 Diamonds, because I got 50 from a Shaman, as well as 50 from the uh, Jungle Demon yesterday, so that is going quite nicely. Alright, just got myself a little key from a Blood Shaman. What will it be? Amulet of Fury, wonderful. Just what I was hoping for, it was one of the few things I needed to upgrade. Warrior Ring isn't that good though, recoil kind of for the win here. Not the best of the best, but we'll take it. Oh, and a Battle Rope Hood, wow. It's not very useful. The Mud Battle Staff I'm keeping on purpose though, because I have some Dragon Bolts that I would like to enchant. Got the Cosmic Runes, saved Water Runes, but then I got a Mud Staff, and I think that's Water and Earth in ones. So, uh, should be able to make some with that. Don't have too many yet, but trying to save up all the runite bolts that I end up finding. Adamant bolts honestly ain't the worst either, but, uh, you know, dragon bolts definitely better. I would have to make uh, separate diamond bolts e with, with the adamant ones, but it takes up so much extra space and all of that, you know. Right, I'm a little retarded. I was looking at this one, which is a water nerf, but that's not what we need. We need astral runes, apparently, to uh, finally create that, so... Gotta keep an eye out for essence in Blink's Open Dose, and I think that's literally the only way that you can obtain them, but... That's okay. I'll be patient. Alright, my elixir just wore off, so I finished the hour. Nothing too crazy, no really good drops, but we get a few diamonds, small amounts. Uh, and a vote bus is about to spawn, so I might get ready to hop off the island. I gotta trade some stuff to tie from like making Dragon Ball Z because uh, I don't have enough bank space even maxed out. You never do, but uh, that's okay. Just gonna finish off this jungle demon and get ready for the vote bus. And after a little break, I still gotta do some stuff IRL. I'll probably do another hour. I'm highly tempted just to just go straight to Naza. The odds of getting a dagger here are pretty damn low. The kills aren't the fastest. Um, I could do a lot more at Jungle Demon all, or at Naza Stroll all by myself compared to if we have some team members on, you know? Maybe in the evening, Skeleton, Ghost, and or Tai, maybe even Goba. And then uh, do Jungle Demon with them and we could get very fast kills in comparison to this. No jung or no uh, Blood Diamonds on that one, sadly, Eva. Alright guys, <clears throat> we're gonna hopefully do some Master TOB again tonight, but Ghost ain't done with work yet and we're not sure what time he's getting home. So until then, I'm gonna go ahead and go back to Karazi and actually do an hour of Nasa Stroll. I have quite a few items prepared, I got the Bone Key, I got the Talon Beast pouch and everything, so... Should be fun! Man, I either got Rusty or Karazi Dagger is just so much better than what I'm using, cause... Uh, it cost me almost all my food for one kill, that's not great. Thank goodness I got a lot of shards right away. Well then, first drop 40 minutes or so in. I lost about 5 minutes at the start for a jungle casket. No accumulator yet, no nothing, which is quite exceptional compared to my uh, Ecom Rush experience here. Those caskets never seem to give anything worthwhile, sadly. Well then, just witnessed a Netlum getting another Scythe of Sanguinesti. Definitely not as first one. The minute I saw Netlum getting a red light, 
I knew it was gonna be the scythe, he always pulls fucking scythes, man, it's insane. And now that someone pulls a scythe of Sanguinesti, I just have a, such a strong feeling we are not gonna see it in our group for a while, but we're gonna try tonight. You never know, but... Damn, bro, that dude just pulls one Sang Scythe after another. I bet he hasn't TOB'd in a while. Just got back into it a bit, and oh, look, another Scythe. <laughs> oh, love that guy, but oh, so jealous. Well, that is the hour over. Only drop I got was a jungle casket. That might be my worst NAS hour ever. And I've done quite a few hours. That is pretty amazing, considering the photo leaks. All right, on skeleton real quick before we raid the trade in two mystery tickets. Wow, he still got some bonus tokens from that. Nice. But no. Uh, and with that other one, it will be enough to buy one exotic ant box. Please, dear lord, give us the Flemberg. Hmm, interesting. <laughs> Actually, not the worst, because... Uh, he can re-roll his other tasks with that, because they are pretty shit. And I know he wanted to do that. It's only 500, so he's even saving some. Ah, still though, a little disappointing. 